COVID-19 is not the only virus that impacts our ability to smell, but what's unique about it is the way in which it does so. Um, so if we get the common cold, um, you know, you're, you're going to have um, an inflammatory response in the nose and that's going to create all sorts of mucus and that then mutes down uh, or, or uh, comes down your ability to um, smell, right? So it basically just becomes a muted sense. Um, what's unique about COVID is that it actually is not nasal congestion or that nasal inflammatory response that is causing um, the smell loss. It's because the virus actually crosses the blood brain barrier um, and uh, gets into the nervous system. And so it's affecting the nervous system and the neural connections that are necessary to um, detect odor and then to, um, you know, to, to interpret it. So with COVID-19, um, because it, the virus invades the nervous system, or affects the nervous system, um, it, it is often resulting in profound loss and a complete inability to smell. Um, and that is uh, really taking its toll on a lot of the people um, who have not had their sense of smell, sometimes for months, um, sometimes some people, you know, upwards of almost a year at this point. Um, and it's scary, right? If, if you can't smell smoke, um, you re are relying on a smoke detector to tell you there's a fire. Um, and so, you know, it really is impacting quality of life. Um, in addition, you know, food doesn't taste good because you can't, you need smell in order to taste. Um, and so people, some people are reporting weight loss um, or that they're just not able to take pleasure in the things that they've, you know, they previously found, found pleasurable. Our sense of smell is really important for, um, you know, daily functions. Um, it, there's research that, you know, suggests that our sense of smell can um, un, sort of unconsciously, so not that we're aware of it, but it can influence our um, attractiveness to certain people. Um, it's one of the ways in which we, um, you know, select mates that are less genetically similar to us to, you know, um, be an advantage for reproduction. Uh, it can also um, help us detect fear in others, um, right, which is, you know, important for survival. Um, and so it is an important sense and it does drive, uh, you know, subtly drive a lot of the decisions that we make on a daily basis, but we're not consciously aware of that most of the time.